Okay. Hello, everybody. How you doing? This is Lance Bansko blog, Bansko app, on Wednesday, the 23rd of February, 2022. I'm with Anthony, who's on the camera. How you doing, Anthony? Good, good, very good. We've just, uh, and there's Richard up there, of course. Good morning. Thank Richard for his amazing snow reports. So what a day, eh, Anthony? Fantastic, beautiful snow. And we've just had the most amazing deep powder to our left. Now, how much fresh powder was there last night, do you think? What? About 30 centimetres, yes. And here's the face of those sweet tones. <laughs> okay. So we're in the bowl. Underneath Bunderitsa 1 chairlift, which comes up from the top of the gondola lift. You may be able to just see that. And this is one of our favourite runs, isn't it, Richard? It is indeed. First thing in the morning is that. There's still, well, I don't know what time it is. Let's say 10.30ish, course to 11. There's still some really nice fresh tracks to be had here. And uh, we just popped out by the trees here. So all in all, things are good. Uh, Anthony, where were you last night? Uh, I was in the, uh, the Irish bar. The Irish harp bar, Irish yes. Harp bar, yeah. yeah. Absolutely beautiful. Fantastic food, lovely beer, fantastic service. Yeah, it was, it was, wasn't it? And Richard, you were there too, weren't you? I was indeed. Yeah, enjoying your, your uh, what beer did you have? It was, uh, some, it was a, a blonde beer. A blonde beer. Okay. Quite hoppy, very nice. Okay, less of the beer and more of that view. We're going to just take you down here, or try to, and show you how good it is. Now, these are the days, if you're a skier, if you're a snowboarder, you know exactly what these days are about. If you're a skier, you may want to rent some wider skis. If this, these are part of the advanced range, head cores. I've been using these for a few years now on these sort of days. And they're good on the piece with the lumps and great off-piste in the powdery stuff. So the quality of the snow is really good, isn't it? Yeah, have a look here. So yeah, have a look. It's pretty deep. You can't make a snowball out of it. It just disintegrates. Lovely powder. So it's dry snow, that, which is exactly what we want. And I think we... Left in the powdery bit. I'll try to, yeah. Okay. After you, Richard. It'll be good to have Ooh. an Anthony ahead. So you can be on, on video. There we go. There we go. Oh, it's very, very beautifully powdery. I really need some... <laughs> I really need uh, sticks to turn. But there we go. Back on the piece now. Busy week, obviously, half-term week. But if you're a teacher, then you have to go in the school holidays. And Anthony's been coming for many years, so he's got the score, gets a lift up. Look at this powder up there. <laughs> he took a tumble. Very nice, you can see the depth. Anyhow, are you coming out next week? If so, we have got a super treat for you. There's going to be a load of snow, and I'm talking 40 centimetres plus, arriving on this Sunday coming up, and Monday. So, if you want to do a last minute trip, this will be a terrific week to do it. There we go, well done. Where's Anthony? Okay, there he is. So Anthony contacted me, saying he'd love to be on one of the vlogs. So, time allowing, what's I like to do? They're doing very well. So this is a Tomba run. It's getting pretty good. There's probably, yeah, just a few little harder bits underneath this soft stuff. But busy. 
that's for sure. But it is every year, this. These two UK holiday half-term weeks. I think it coincides with some Israeli holidays. And uh, if you want less people, then come after the 14th of January. Uh, of uh, March, I do apologise. And if you're coming in January next year, around about the 12th, 13th of January, that week is a really good week to come in terms of people. You can tell I'm struggling to talk and, and ski down. Lots of good places to eat. We mentioned the Harp, but loads of places, local places. You fancy a takeaway, the Harp and Danny's Bar doing takeaways, order.bg slash Bansko brings up those two. The links for all that are in the comment section down below. And here are the guys waiting for me. And here we are. How was that? Anthony? It's excellent, yeah. Do you want to do a shout out for anyone in Wales? Hi to all the guys in work. What work is this? Uh, we're the fire service. Fire service. The training department in uh, Mid and West Wales, Fire and Rescue Service. Very good. Hi to everyone in the fire service. Do a great job. Richard, hi to anyone? Uh, friends, family, home. Okay. Home. Hello, Mum. <laughs> Hello, Freddy, <laughs> and everyone who knows me. Thank you for watching. Uh, anything else you want to say to, about today? It's been good, hasn't it? Apart from uh, waiting a oh, yes. length of time at the Kalaski lift, I think they didn't get it open until 20 minutes, at least 20 minutes after it should have done. Correct. Very, a lot of frustrated people. Yeah, that's Richard's rant today. Uh, have we got any other rants? No. I think everything's been pretty good. I mean, obviously, if you've been queuing, you'll be frustrated, but it wasn't as if we haven't warned you Indeed. about queues and how to avoid them. Be early, get the taxi up, and possibly, if you can, buy a VIP pass. Or one of those buses across A bus. Days. Absolutely. Even the queue for the buses is extraordinary. Yeah, it's been busy. There's no doubt about it. But that is what it is, as we keep on saying. And I was saying earlier, if you have a partner who's a teacher, Anthony... <laughs> That's why he's here <laughs> at this time. Brilliant. Yeah. It should be a lot quieter next week, surely. Uh, it will be quieter. It won't be. Remember, the 3rd of March is Independence Day. Uh, celebrating, I think, independence from the Ottomans. And uh, 1st of March, as you know, is Baba Mata Day. Oh, yeah. You'll see lots of these red and white gifts that you put on people's wrists. And you're only supposed to take them off once you see a stalk. Correct. Which might mean a long time if you've flown back to the UK or anywhere else <laughs> to, to go to the zoo to see the stork. So yes, it's a nice greeting. It's an old pagan tradition, I guess. Uh, and we're here. I wanted to show you this sneaky little black by the side of the tomba. 9B. 9B, yes. Rather beautiful right now, isn't it? It was a bit misty earlier, but really nice. When it's busy like this, the big tip is to go to... Challen Balog. Yeah. So, all go on the harder slopes if you can. This isn't busy, is it? Yeah. So, Anthony, your 15 minutes of fame is nearly up. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, just say goodbye and thanks for watching, everybody. Ciao, ciao. See you in the next one. Bye bye. See ya. And let's see if I can turn it off. <laughs>